Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to show you how to make a simple stethoscope pendant. I'd say this is a pretty beginner friendly design. If you'd like to see my start to finish process, stay tuned. So I'm going to start by shaping what's called the chest piece and I'm using 18 gauge dead soft silver colored artistic wire and this piece is around eight and a half inches long and I'm going to start using my bailing pliers to bend my wire right in the center. And I'm bringing this all the way around to make a loop. Now I'll attach my bead and coil this together with 28 gauge wire. This is also silver colored artistic wire. And for now, I'm not gonna cut a piece. I'm just gonna use it right off the spool. And I have this little three millimeter bead. And I'm gonna hold that inside my loop while I coil the weaving wire to one side. Once I've got that anchored to the base wire, I can adjust the position a little bit and start coiling up the rest of it to make what's called the tubing. and I'll finish coiling this off camera. Okay, so I coiled about an inch and a half up my base wire. And of course, as I coiled, I stopped periodically to flatten my weaving wire and push it down a little bit with my flat nose pliers just to keep everything nice and tight. Now I'll go ahead and cut a long tail of my weaving wire. This is probably about 24 inches long. I definitely won't need that much, but I always prefer to cut my wire a bit longer than I think I'll need, so I don't risk running out before I'm done coiling. 
Now we can separate these base wires and shape what's called the binaural, it's also called the ear tubes. I'm going to coil up this side just a little bit. Before I finish that, I'm going to go ahead and shape my tube. And I want to keep these two wires I've coiled together from twisting up as I shape this, so I'll use my flat nose pliers to keep them flat as I go. Now I'll use my baling pliers to finish shaping the binaural. And then I'm gonna coil up a little more and bring my wire over to create what's called the binaural spring. And I'll finish coiling this off camera.
now we can shape what's called the ear pieces. And then I'll tie these together with a piece of 28 gauge weaving wire.
All right, and there is our finished stethoscope. And you know I love to show you variations on my designs, so you can actually use a larger bead for this piece if you prefer. And this one I shaped my tube differently and I didn't add a bead to the chest piece because that's where one side of it hangs from the necklace chain. And I do have a micro tutorial for this one on my Instagram and TikTok and those links are in the description. All right guys, thanks so much for joining me today. I really hope you enjoyed this project. Let me know what you think in the comments. If you'd like to help me make more of these tutorials, please hit the like button and don't forget to subscribe and tap the bell so you get notified every time I upload a new video. And if you follow me on Instagram or TikTok, feel free to share pictures or videos of your creations with me. I love to see what my tutorials inspire. And if you don't follow me on those platforms, make sure you do so because I post lots of fun content on TikTok and IG that you won't see here on my YouTube channel. And I just wanna end by saying have a fantastic day and remember to love your neighbor as yourself and in all things treat others as you want to be treated for this is the law and the prophets. God bless you guys and I hope to see you in the next video.